Welcome to Decode Your DEXA. The information presented here is not intended to replace medical advice. What is a DEXA scan? A DEXA is the gold standard of body composition testing. It's a dual beam x-ray and simply refers to the type of technology used in our test. Before every event, we run a QA test. This ensures our accuracy. BodySpec is proud that we have a proven 0.5% error gradient. You want to make sure you keep the variables the same from scan to scan to ensure an apples to apples comparison. Is it safe? Yes. A total body DEXA emits the lowest radiation of all X-ray technology. A single DEXA produces 0.4 microsieverts of radiation. To put that into perspective, that's the same as eating four bananas in a day. So now let's dig into your report. So after I finish going through this PDF file, I'm going to dig in to our brand new beta report. BodySpec is really excited to have launched this brand new interactive beta report, and I'm thrilled to be able to go through that with you. But right now I'm going to go through this PDF so you understand exactly what you're looking at. On the right hand side, you can see a snapshot of what this file looks like. So at the very top where you see your name, birthday, height, and weight, that is what you filled out on your intake form. Underneath the summary results to the far right where it says bone mineral content, this is the weight of your hollow bone. Next to that, the lean tissue, this is everything that is not fat or bone. Muscle, blood, fluid, organs, undigested food, that's included in lean tissue. Fat tissue is strictly fat. Total mass is your weight then we give you your body fat percentage. Next, we have the body fat percentile chart. This is strictly a comparison to body spec clients. However, we have done well over 250,000 scans included in this chart, but this is not a comparison to the general population. So what you wanna do is take your body fat percentage, plug it into this chart, and this gives you a comparison to other body spec clients. Zero to 20th percentile, this is the leanest category of body spec clients, 80th to the 99th, that category of body spec clients have had a higher body fat percentage. Next, let's get into the regional assessment. Here, we're just breaking your body into different areas and giving you the composition of those key regions. So the main areas are your arms, legs, and trunk. Arms and legs are self-explanatory. Your trunk is everything except the arms, legs, and head. Then what we do with the trunk is we take out your android and gynoid. So your android is your midsection. So android, think A for abs around that waist area. Gynoid, think G for glutes, hips, glutes, and upper thighs. The goal here is to have your android fat percentage to be less than your total body fat percentage and your AG ratio less than one. That is an indicator of the lowest health risks. Next, let's move on to your RMR, so your resting metabolic rate. This is the minimum number of calories you're burning at rest doing nothing. So this number will increase with a lean tissue increase and it will decrease with a lean tissue decrease. That is because muscle actually requires more energy than fat. So now let's move on to visceral fat, VAT, in the mid middle of page two. So visceral fat is not necessary. This is the unhealthy fat that accumulates around the organs in the midsection of the body. A DEXA scan is the only body composition testing method that can detect visceral fat because of the density of that. So the average female has 0.85 pounds of visceral fat. The average male has between one and one and a half pounds of visceral fat. This is the fat that you should be focused on because this is the fat that is associated with metabolic disease, type two diabetes and other health complications. So diet, exercise, sleep and stress, those are all things that can contribute to visceral fat. So on that page, there's a pink number one that shows you where visceral fat lies in the body. We focus on the pounds of visceral fat. Below the mass, you can see the volume. Those are actually the same thing, 
we compare the pounds of visceral fat over time just because it's an easier number to refer to. So the goal here is to get those pounds of visceral fat as low as you can possibly get them over time. And again, diet, exercise, sleep, and stress, those are all habits that can contribute to the lowering and the raising of visceral fat. Getting those things in check are the way that we want to get that visceral fat down. Next, moving on to the bone report. Here, what we focus on is your age-matched Z-score. The higher the number, the better. We are not doing a diagnostic bone density exam. However, your age-matched Z-score still provides a great snapshot of overall bone strength. So you take that Z-score number, plug it into the chart to the right, and this compares your bone strength to people in your same demographic. Next, moving to the bottom of the page, the muscle balance report, we're comparing your limbs. We're comparing your right arm to your left and your right leg to your left. We're looking for a difference of two pounds or more in the lean mass column. Anything less than this is considered to be normal. So right arm versus left, right leg versus left. We generally don't call out anything less than two pounds difference between either side. Now let's dig into our brand new beta report. So if you go to your dashboard on bodyspec.com, you can first see that there's an area here that says reports. This will actually give you a singular view of all of your reports over time. Next, we have the report builder. This will actually default to a comparison of all of your scans over time. You can also unselect the all scans and compare your scans for a specific time period or any specific scans you want at all to just see how you've done over any particular time period that you'd like. Next, once you generate your report, you can see comparisons and key measurements. So at the very top, you'll see all of the scans that you've chosen to compare, starting with the most recent, and then you'll see some subsections of our key measurements, body fat percentage, visceral fat, lean mass, and bone density. And here, the comparisons you'll see is your most recent scan to the scan right before it. Our beta report is also interactive. So how you can use this interactive report is first, you can click and drag on the GIF to zoom in, and then you'll double click to zoom out. It's extremely insightful. Another great new feature we have are our key takeaways. So your strengths will show you the areas that you are performing the best in. And we also provide you with action items, which are some recommendations on some things that you may wanna do a bit better. Next, the average monthly scanner over the course of a year loses 19% of their starting body fat. This is a great reason to get a monthly membership with body spec. Scanning regularly keeps you accountable to your goals. So what's next? The next thing to do is schedule your next scan. This is just a way to stay accountable and give you a benchmark for something to work towards. Again, our members lose 19% of their body fat over the course of a year. That's an excellent thing to work towards. So go ahead and sign up and call the support team and we would be more than happy to get you started. A body spec membership represents a commitment to your continued health. Thanks so much for stopping by. And again, please contact us if you need anything.